This is Mona Atahawi, and as always, fuck the patriarchy. Reopening America. Anyone who says that, says that because they're not seeing those who have kept America open. The invisible, the uninsured, the undocumented, the poor, the working class, those who have been endangering their lives to keep this country open. Let's talk about them because social distancing is a privilege. So let's talk about those who can't social distance, who are keeping America open. Among the US workforce, just 16.2% of Latinx workers, just 19.7% of black American workers have been able to work from home. In contrast, 30% of white workers and 37% of Asian American workers have been able to work from home. Because in America, it's always race, class, and gender. So what is this Reopen America about? It's about the economy. Whose economy? After 9-11, George W. Bush said, go shopping for the economy. Now, Donald Trump is saying, get out there, reopen America for the economy. Whose economy is this? Because who's keeping America open right now? Again, those you don't see. The farm workers you don't see. The grocery store workers, the paramedics, the sanitation workers, those who work in senior citizens' homes, those who work on the front lines in hospitals, not just doctors and nurses, but the auxiliaries, the janitors, everyone you don't see, all of those people, the delivery workers who bring your food, all of those people have been keeping America open. What does the economy do for them? So before you start talking about reopening America, here's something that I want you to reconsider. There are enough houses and apartments, no one should be homeless. There is enough food, no one should be hungry. There is enough healthcare, no one should go without healthcare. And there is enough money, no one should be poor. So who is this economy for? To answer that, always say fuck the patriarchy, especially the capitalist patriarchy.